Hello, this is Nick. Today I'm going to explain what Google Chrome is. Um, so basically, if you don't have Google Chrome, it's, it's a free download Google puts out. It, what it is, it's an alternative browser to Internet Explorer. Um, so generally, when you surf the web, you open up Internet Explorer and look some, maybe something like this. Maybe your home page will be MSN. And this is generally how you surf the web. Um, with Google Chrome, basically just another way to surf the web. And as, as you can see, it's a little simplified. It looks a lot like Internet Explorer 10.0. Uh, but you can go in here and you can go MSN just like you would in Internet Explorer. So I guess the main reason becomes why would you want to use this instead of Internet Explorer? Um, one of the key features with Google Chrome is the speed. If you use Internet Explorer in the past, you probably have noticed it can run slow um, many times and it's just because of all the security updates Microsoft has, has to push into their product because it's so attacked by viruses and virus makers and hackers. Um, that's another benefit of Chrome. Not as many virus makers attack it. It's because of the different software. So it is actually more secure than Internet Explorer. Um, they try to keep it pretty simple, just having your back forward um, stuff right here put all the settings over here. I'm gonna go into a little bit of detail, but not too much. So when you first open up Chrome, um, you probably might have come up to this page. Now, if you don't wanna fill your information out, you don't have to, you can skip this. The one positive about filling this out is if you do, it will actually import um, your favorites. So if you start putting favorites into I'm just going to start downloading them here. It'll actually import my favorites from my other computers. So I have a laptop, or maybe a work computer. It's going to move all my favorites over to this computer. Um, another thing it'll do is you can even put the app on your phone and have all your bookmarks there as well. Uh, it can synchronize your search history and it can synchronize your passwords. So as you can see, it just pulled up all my uh, favorites, my quick links, um, which is, is very nice. Um, couple of other things that it has is it has add-ons actually that's what we're doing installing right now is installing some add-ons that we have uh, so these are my different add-ons that we have and so you can search for different add-ons if you want um, we one of the reasons that I also like this it is has flashed flash Adobe flash baked into the software so instead of having to download uh, flash separately it constantly gets the updates from flash and a lot of viruses um, basically attack your system with uh, a flash vulnerability so having it um, kind of baked into the software is a really nice security feature so I just pretty much de finished downloading my add-ons I kept a couple add-ons here um, let's look at a couple settings if you wanted to go in and change your home page that's something um, a lot of people do Go to advanced settings. Well, we can change our search right here. We can go through, change your appearance, so you can get a skin. If you want to change your home page, we're going to go on startup, hit set page. And if you just want it to be Google, you can just put in Google right here and save it. And then I believe that's the default page. You can have multiple pages open up. So if we can see what this looks like, we're going to open this up. And you can see it open up three different pages uh, simultaneously. Um, so that's a really neat feature. Um, yeah, I, I would suggest giving uh, Google Chrome a try. This is just a quick overview. One of the neat features it has is um, this kind of privacy right here. So this way you're not getting tracked. There's no cookies being downloaded. Uh, it's all cleared out of your history. That's some uh, nice feature. And it just has a really nice clean interface. Very simple to use. Um, it, it is an Internet Explorer 10 point, very similar to that. So there's not too many other settings that are different from Internet Explorer. But I recommend you give it a try in addition to maybe using Internet Explorer uh, and, and see uh, which one you like best. All right. Thanks.